Hi guys, it's Mrs. Gallagher on the other side of this screen. I'm here to read the book, I Like Myself, that we read the other day. Um, it took me a little while to get this uploaded because I was having trouble taping this um, with the document camera that I had. So I'm doing it from my phone. This is called I Like Myself by Karen Beaumont. Remember the cute little dog? I like myself. I'm glad I'm me. There's no one else I'd rather be. I like my eyes, my ears, my nose. I like my fingers and my toes. I like me wild. I like me tame. I like me different and the same. I like me fast and I like me slow. I like me everywhere I go. I like me on the inside too, for all I think and say and do. Inside, outside, upside down, from head to toe and all around. I like it all, it all is me, and me is all I want to be. And I don't care in any way what someone else may think or say. I may be called a silly nut or a crazy cuckoo bird, so what? I'm having too much fun, you see, for anything to bother me. <laughs> Even when I look a mess, I still don't like me any less. Cause nothing in this world, you know, can change what's deep inside. And so, no matter if they stop and stare, no person ever anywhere can make me feel that what they see is all there really is to me. I'd still like me with fleas or warts or with a silly snout that snorts. Or knobby knees or hippo hips or purple polka dotted lips or beaver breath, or stinky toes, or horns protruding from my nose. Or yikes with spikes all down my spine, or hair that's like a porcupine. I still would be the same, you see. I like myself because I'm me. The end. And that's a really important book because no matter what, you should always, always, always love yourself just the way you are. And I love every single one of you. All right. Goodbye for now.